Well, some lawmakers and experts say that medical debt is a growing burden for millions and millions of people across the country. Senators are looking for ways to address this debt crisis so average Americans are not buried under hundreds or even thousands of dollars. National correspondent Basil John reports on the hearing. Senators on Capitol Hill are worried about the stranglehold medical debt has on millions of Americans. Punished financially for what crime? Are you diagnosed with cancer? That should not be happening. Vermont Senator Bernie Sanders held a hearing to figure out what Congress can do to end the medical debt crisis in the country. He says more than 60 percent of people with health insurance have racked up medical debt. You run the risk of destroying the financial stability of your family. Is that really where we are as a nation? Louisiana Republican Senator Bill Cassidy and Indiana Republican Senator Mike Braun agree the last thing people should worry about is medical debt. The medical debt is a symptom of a larger problem, uh, that the, the, the high cost of health care. The reason we have medical debt is because it costs too much in the first place. Experts told lawmakers this issue should not be happening in a country with as much wealth as the United States. Is there any other country in the world where that takes place? No, not in the rich world. Uh, countries as rich or close to as rich as the United States do not see this level of catastrophic health expenditure, not even close. Also of concern, debt collectors who harass people burdened by their debts. I think it's just the ever constant threat of someone calling to inquire for something that we were not able to pay. Um, it Does also that happen also often? I would say multiple times a day. Lawmakers promised to bring reforms to relieve the financial pressure on Americans. Reporting in Washington, I'm Basil John.